Hello, welcome to Biograde TV. If you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss our next video. Major ethnic groups in Gabon and their peculiarities. The Central African country of Gabon is one of the multi-ethnic countries on the African continent. Here are the major ethnic groups in the country and their peculiarities. Fang. The Fang ethnic group is the largest ethnic group in Gabon, making up about a quarter of the population or 25%. They speak the Fang language. It is also known as Pahun. It belongs to the Niger-Congo family of languages. The Fang practice a patrilineal kinship social structure. The villages are linked through lineages. Polygamy is practiced among the Fang. They are also an exogamous society, which means they often marry outside their clans. The Fang are quite famous for their knowledge of animals, plants, and herbs. They are predominantly agrarian. Cocoa has been their major crop since the colonial era. They also practice hunting. Many Fang people converted to Christianity during French colonial rule. However, after Gabon gained independence, there was a revival of interest in their own traditional religion called Biri. It is quite common to see a blend of traditional practices with Christian ideas. For example, Fang people observe a celebration called Buiti, which is used to mark Christian Easter, but it lasts for four days and engages other religious observances not typically associated with Easter. The artworks of Fang people are well known. Numerous museums around the world have on display their wooden masks and idol carvings. Their artworks inspired a lot of European avant-garde works of the 20th century. Much of the art is either used for their religious masquerades or function as effigies. Music plays a major role in the oral history of the Fang. The mve, which is a stringed instrument, is one of their most popular musical instruments. A person who is killed playing this instrument is called a mbomo mve. It takes years of dedication and sacrifice to become a master mbomo mve. The mbomo mve usually visits each village monthly to play at the village squares where the villagers gather to be entertained. Leon Mba, who was Gabon's first president after independence in 1960, was from the Fang ethnic group. Teke ethnic group The Teke are a minority in Gabon, numbering about 160,000 people from Gabon's total population of about 2 million. The language of Teke people is Kiteke language or Etio. Like the Fang language, it is a Bantu language which also belongs to the larger Niger-Congo language family. The Teke are known for their arts. Teke statues have a religious function but are also used for magic. They mainly have two types of statues, the Nkida which do not hold any magic and the Buti which does. These people are primarily farmers. They practice two types of large-scale cultivation forest plantation known as Ngunu and savanna plantations called Ntieni. They also keep small gardens behind their houses in the village. Forest plantations are the major sources of cultivated foods for the Teke. The men fell the large trees in the new plantation while the women carry out the planting, weeding and harvesting. Savanna plantations are usually done between October and November. Yams are the main crops planted but manioc is also planted sometimes. A Teke community is headed by a king who has political authority but above all serves as the religious leader. The Teke king is considered sacred as he is the intermediary between the spirits and the living. The king's main responsibility is to preserve the prosperity of his kingdom by carrying out specific rituals. The enthronement ceremony for a king usually takes up to two years to be fully completed. Nzami is the supreme being that the Teke believe in. 
However, they worship spirits of nature under the supervision of a diviner known as Nganga. A person ascends to become an Nganga either by inheriting the position or following a dream. The Nganga usually possesses a statuette which is believed to contain the soul of an ancestor called Tamakui. The cult of the ancestors is very important among the Teke. The ancestors are believed to live in the sacred forest, near rivers, in clearings, and caves. If the descendants do not honor and pay obeisance to their ancestors, they believe that they will come back to torment them, be it with sickness or mental illness. Hence, each family worships its ancestors. Ali Bongo Ondimba, current president of Gabon, is from the Teke ethnic group. The Nzebe, Mayene, Banjabi, Eshira, Bapunu, and Bakota are some of the other ethnic groups in Gabon. Which have we missed out of these ethnic groups? Let's know in the comment section. Will it be ridiculous to subscribe to our channel? If no, please like this video, share, and subscribe to our channel.